Hours must have passed while the captain told her story, but nobody seemed to care. We were all so consumed by what she was telling us. Consumed by the blood-stained past. Well now, you're the one I've heard about from the head clan of the Gaokishi style. Two people can't be crowned the strongest in this city. <laughs> Team Katana, Mitsuomi might be able to fill my shoes when I'm gone. You should have seen that. Toto Academy Senior and Executive Council President. She Natsume is ready to fight! <laughs> it started with the captain of the Juken Club, Maya Natsume, and my older brother Mitsuomi Takayanagi's initial encounter. And our captain ended it with the horrible truth about her brother's past. <laughs> Sheen Natsume. <laughs> you know, that was one hell of a story. What's up? Why are you so quiet? It's just crazy. When the midget girl started getting into all the details, it started giving me the shivers, man. Does that seem kind of weird? Nope. That sounds like you. You know what? This whole thing makes me wish I could have entered Toto Academy like two years ago. Maybe then I could have helped the midget out a little bit. Maybe then things would have been different. If I'd have been born two years earlier, things might have gone better. Hmm. Maybe you're right. Mitsuomi. What? Come on, it's only eight o'clock now? It's already 8 o'clock. Now get up. What? You're here? When did you get back? Just a few minutes ago. That watermelon is your souvenir. <sighs> if I make some breakfast, will you eat it? You should eat much better than you do. Slow down. What's up with that wound? Forget about breakfast. I can make something. You should get some sleep. Oh, don't worry. I'm fine. But there is something I'd like to ask you. Hmm? Have you fallen in love with somebody? Uh -huh. I see a dragon now. <laughs> the captain revealed a lot to us last night. But I still don't know why my brother changed. He didn't used to be like this at all. What happened to him? Masataka, I've got a meeting with the board of directors. I won't be home until late. You'll have to get your own dinner tonight. Yeah. I heard that you and Mitsuomi got into a little tiff recently. I've made it clear that your brother is no longer part of this family. Please try to respect that. By the way, Masataka, have you perhaps fallen for some girl? <laughs> I happen to notice another yellow stain on your sheets this morning. Ah! Stop! That's right, <clears throat> Jackie, time to get up. Uh, since when do you care if you're late? I don't care. What I meant was that you're going to be late. No, I'm not. I've got a whole new plan now. Hmm? Starting today, I'm quitting school and going to work. That way I can support you. And then you can drop out of Toto and go someplace normal. You can go to that school and keep getting beaten up all the time. <laughs> or you can sleep with me till noon every day. Which do you prefer? You're talking crazy, and you know it. Hey, where are you going? I'm really serious. All right, I'm out of here. Suichiro, it's going to be hellishly hot today. Are you sure you want to wear that? 
It's a tough guy thing. You sure you don't want to stay, Bob? Don't worry, Chiaki. I'll be back. Hold on. Wait for me, sis. I'm just gonna leave if you can't get your act together. I've never seen anyone sleep as much as you. I'm sure is a nice way to start the day. Hey there, Senpai. Good morning. Yeah, morning. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like someone's gotten popular, Senpai. Huh? What's that? <laughs> Don't try to play dumb. You sound a little jealous there. Yeah, you wish. Not a hard ass like me. Girls don't want anything to do with a tough guy. Soichiro-sama! <laughs> Good morning. How are you? Soichiro-sama? What are you doing? Get off me! What was that about the chicks having nothing to do with you? Don't make me kick your ass. <clears throat> Good morning, everyone. Uh, Good morning, Captain. Good morning. morning. It's the Jukin Club. Look, Jukin Club. Five of them were able to take on over 200 guys. And they don't even look that tough. Bummer! Maya decided to come as the little version today. Hey, Bob, check it out. I think that we're all famous now. Yeah. Yes, but all this means is that you boys are more of a target. This is where your real training is gonna start, so be ready. See? Oh, yeah. She's right. Looks like we're gonna have our hands full for a while. Miss Natsume, could I please have a word with you? Good morning, nice to see you, Master Toto. What's this old dude about? He's the master, Bonehead. In other words, he's the principal of the whole academy. This matter is quite important. I'm sure you know what it entails. <laughs> Don't worry, it's no big deal. After you, sir. Hmm. Oh, one last thing. Don't be late. I have something important to go over later. So please be on time for our meeting, everyone. <laughs> this is so hot. Looks like we don't gotta worry about any freshmen wanting to go up against us anymore. They're all too scared. Could you try to play it a little cooler, maybe? Good news. Looks like there's still a few guys left at this school with a decent pair of balls on them. Yeah. They're already at it again. Their challenger is the master of the Hokushin Ito style. I believe that boy's name is Kanakita. Third Kendo Club and that young man is their new rising star. Almost his whole club was involved in the bowling alley incident. And nearly half were sent to the hospital afterwards to recover. Same thing happened to several of the other clubs. I'm afraid we're going to have a lot more incidents like that one there. <sighs> what do you propose we do, Miss Natsume? It started with Ryuzaki. I handed him a rather crushing defeat. Because of the orders he carried out on behalf of the Executive Council, that angered the Council, and as a result, it created this war that you see going on now. All of this is actually my fault. Hmm. Although not everyone would be happy if I were to receive some sort of punishment, it would at least keep fights like that one over there from breaking out every day. What do you think? Hmm. Well, the Masters are conferring right now to make that very same decision, Miss Natsume. You may wait here until they're done, and in the meantime, you may want to consider preparing yourself for the worst. Well, look at who we have here. I hope you two are in the mood for a good beating today. I'm gonna give you guys a little gift. I'd hate for people to say I had an unfair advantage. <laughs> Is this your attempt at Bushido? That was really dumb. I know you think you're being all warrior-like, but you just lost the only chance you had of winning this fight. No, 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 boys. I'm afraid the advantage is in my hands. Because I'm fighting with a real katana, I'll do my best while defeating you to avoid any vital parts. I get it. He doesn't have any balls at all. This little freak's too scared to come after us with his bare fists. Yeah! 
Watch out! The sooner you stop dodging, the sooner this will end! Resistance will only cause pain! I wouldn't be so sure! Hey, Suichiro, isn't getting rid of monsters your specialty? Do something about this crazy kappa! Yeah? Well, why don't you do it? No way! You're the one who's got some special attack! That Tanshina something! You can pull that attack off from long range, can't you? Oh, yeah, you're right! But it takes time for me to build up enough chi to use that thing. So the only way we can use this attack is if you buy me some time by risking your neck against that dude. Sure. Screw that! Don't leave this freak for me! <laughs> Senpai said even if I were to kill you, they'd still write the whole thing off as an accident. But because I'm basically a nice guy, I'm just gonna take one of your arms. Oh man, I'm hosed. This freaking Kappa's totally serious about this. is carrying a katana against a larger mass and a stronger power it will be rendered useless there's no way that someone of kanakita's caliber could have ever stopped his kick very well i understand the punishment you'll receive has been officially decided don't be upset by their decision i apologize for creating trouble it was nice to learn from you master not so mad Summer's already here. The preliminaries will begin soon. The way those two boys have improved is impressive. But that has little to do with my coaching. They are both so talented and their potential is limitless. All of this is coming to fruition now, not because of me, but because of their recent battles. I know this could never really happen, but if they'd come here two years earlier, you know, even if they'd come to the school just one year earlier, then maybe, maybe things would have turned out differently. You serious, sis? You've been expelled? But, what'd you do? Shoplift from the student store or something? I'm not as stupid as you are, you idiot! The bowling alley have something to do with this? Nothing at all. I've been expecting this decision for quite some time. To tell you the truth, I found it odd they waited this long to do something about the run-ins we've had with the Executive Council. They were good enough to grant me one request. I asked for a grace period before the expulsion begins, and they agreed. For now, I can come to school for the rest of the semester. With that said, there's barely a month left. And in that amount of time, there's much I want to accomplish. The announcement is official now. They have decided to expel Natsume. I see. Is the Executive Council going to accept that decision? Yeah. As you wish. But, sir, do you really feel that she got what she deserved? Okay, so the Daito style is still regarded as the oldest hand-to-hand -hand combat method used in our country. People used to refer to it as the root of many of the popular styles. However, look at something like fast kick sumo wrestling and the moves from the Kongo type method as shown in Kojiki. And this theory doesn't really stand up. It's a nice day out today, isn't it, boy? I was surprised you finally showed up to one of my lectures, but it turns out you only came to Suntan. Can you tell me what I was just discussing with the class? Well, maybe if I'd been listening, I'd have a friggin' clue. 
Now look what you've done. You've just caused damage to school property. Uh, so tell me, are you still thinking about disrespecting me now, hmm? You mouth off again and the property on your face will get destroyed. Dude, can you get your finger out from under my nose? Mm. I don't mean to be rude, but it kind of smells like jizz. What? <laughs> wow, you sure do have some nerve there, kid. Just give it a rest, Suichiro. Mm. I feel sorry for Natsume. That girl took an expulsion to protect lowlifes like you. Do you at least feel guilty? Hmm? <clears throat> you thinking of taking me on, huh? If you think the masters at this academy are just ordinary teachers... You're sadly mistaken. <laughs> that ain't nothing! Chill out, Bob. You're making me all anxious having to watch this crap. Hey, is that really true? The stuff you said about our captain? Do you really think she was trying to protect us? Hey, look, it's a kite. Oh, wait, that a crow? Check it out. What do you think that is? Well, whatever it is, it's squawking, so you figure it out. You know, this whole thing might end up being a perfect opportunity for me in the end. Chiaki's been getting a little freaked out lately, and I don't want to bail on her. I'm in a tough spot, too. It's my mom. You know, she never even thought that I'd make it to high school. A few hours after I got the acceptance letter, I caught her fighting back the tears. Well, we just gotta stay on our toes. Yeah, well, I've been doing that all along. I don't think she has any idea how much I try to look out for her. Is something wrong? Nope. It's all good. Hey, Bob. Hmm? You know, I think that thing is a crow. No shit. Tell me, brother. I need to know. Are you mad at me? If you wanted me to defeat him, then I just passed up a perfect chance to do it. But I couldn't even move a muscle. I'm sorry if I let you down. I've tried my best in the last two years, but I can't avenge your death. It seems I won't be able to defeat Mitsuomi after all. It's unlocked, but how? I'm the only one who's ever had a key to that room. What, you want more? Didn't get enough bowling? Oh! Hey! This is the Executive Council's headquarters, right boys? We don't have time to mess with you guys. Just go and tell your boss we want to see him, you damn puppets. I don't think that they're too into getting their boss for us. <laughs> then I guess we just gotta kill him. What's with all the noise? I'm trying to take a nap back here. No, no, it's gone. Nothing else has been touched. It couldn't have been a thief who did this. There's only one other person who knew this was here. Aya! I can't believe she did this! That fool! That katana! She's gone and taken it! I'm